But when it's like when 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 Nori, when he actually said it, it's a door. Like, oh uh, man, when he said it's a door, and he said it in his own words, he started to solidify with those of us that try to wake y'all up all the time, constantly spitting game. Don't tell me in my comment section on my Instagram. When you hear Kanye say, word for word, and use the celebrities that I used, word for word, Bill Cosby, Michael Jordan, back to back, he used the people that I used, and Michael Jackson, laugh after laugh after laugh, and he used it, it's like Kanye is talking to me indirect, Kanye is talk. how Tim Toe say, talk to me, talk back to me. Nigga, Kanye's talking back to me. Never give up how shall we begin? We ain't never giving up. Of course not. We ain't never giving up. It's real in the battlefield, man. It's real. It's real in the battlefield. Oh, I gotta pop my collar. Where you at, Nori? Where you at? Playing no games. I came to bring the pain. I didn't come to play no games, man. Y'all better start listening to me when I speak. It, it, it's a level of success where it's a door. It's a door. When you platinum and you're getting 50000 a show, I've been there. There's a door that you can walk in. I'm not sure if it's homo or if it's Illuminati. I just didn't take that door. I went straight. There's three different doors, right? There's three different ways to walk. There's to the left. There's to the right. And then there's straight. To, straight is your own, your own. Let's see if you continue this success, young man. Let's see if it was all about your skills, young man. Let's really see that. Okay. And you went straight. To the right? I'm not sure if that's the homo shit right there. And then there's to the left. I'm not sure if there's some sacrifice shit going on right there. I'm not sure because I went straight. Yeah. Let me clear my glasses. Because don't nobody, nobody, nobody breaks this shit down like I do. Nobody. Absolutely nobody give you the lives that I give you. That's why I'm the best. I am the best at what I do. Did you hear what he said? He said it's a door. But I broke down those doors. He said, I don't know if it's sacrifice. I don't know if it's homo or if it's bestiality. Yeah. Bestiality. Yes, that's the other door. That is the other door. That's why Kanye said what he said. He said, I don't care if y'all put images out of me sleeping with a goat. He wasn't, he wasn't joking. He's saying, I don't care. These are the last days. And he, he hold up, watch this. Now watch which video I play, then watch what I play next. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it again for you. It's the door. Cause I want you to, I want you to listen to the next video I'm about to play. Kanye ain't the truth, nigga. When he went through the door, he's not the truth. Now he's telling the truth because he's fed up. He's not the truth. When he went through the door, the problem is he didn't know when he went through the door that it was going to be his mother that was sacrificed. But he made a choice when he walked through the door for there to be a sacrifice. It's a, it, it's a level of success where it's a door. It's a door. When you platinum and you're getting 50000 a show, I've been there. There's a door that you can walk in. I'm not sure if it's homo or if it's Illuminati. I just didn't take that door. I went straight. There's three different doors, right? There's three different ways to walk. There's to the left. There's to the right. And then there's straight. To, straight is your own, your own. Let's see if you continue this success, young man. Okay. Let's see if it was all about your skills, young man. Let's really see that. Okay. And you went straight. To the right, 
I'm not sure if that's the homo shit right there. And then there's to the left. I'm not sure if there's some sacrifice shit going on right there. I'm not sure because I went straight. Stay right there, Nori. I'm not sure. I'm not sure because I went straight. You're lying. Show you they can't. They, they, they try to suppress you, but that's how they try to categorize. They can't control me. You get what I'm saying? They can control Shaq. They can control Charles Barkley. They can control LeBron James. They can control Jay Z and Beyonce. No, no, you, man. But they can't control me. No, you see, you. it ain't no name I won't name. Uh, it's up. It's no, up. You. you know what I'm saying? And just for minutes of fair time, I love you. But the way you read that, I took that as a slight. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I'm taking no disrespect. Nope. That's scary. They can't control you. They can't. They, they, they try to suppress you. But that's how they try to categorize. They can't control me. You get what I'm saying? They can control Shaq. They can control Charles Barkley. They can control LeBron James. They can control Jay Z and Beyonce. No, no, you, man. But they can't control me. No, you see, you. it ain't no name I won't name. Uh, it's up. No, you. Just for minutes of fair time, I love you. But the way you read that, I took that as a slight. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I'm taking no disrespect from nobody. So let's get on the phone. Let's talk that out. I don't care who you are. I ain't taking no slice from nobody, right? I ain't taking no slice from nobody. It's God, that's the only person that I serve. My mama ain't here. My mama was sacrificed. Me too. You understand? Yeah. Appreciate Michael you. Jordan. What about him? His dad, right? Bill Cosby, his son, right? Dr. Dre, his son. You know, out in Hollywood, a lot of people come up missing. Feels like it might be a lot of that in order to control, traumatize. They want to monetize and traumatize. And God loved me. You understand? They, they hit me. Gap, Adidas, all that away. Still, Forbes, who hate me, right? Had to write net worth 400 million. Jesus is king. God loved me. And that's more important than being alive. That's the thing. You know what I'm saying? It's, and this truth is going to be heard. Y'all can't send none of y'all meat mills, y'all puppies, y'all little boozy, none of these names, none of these people that have to listen to y'all because they're dealing with, they have legal, I never killed nobody, right? I'm the pussy that never killed nobody, right? But that means I can say whatever I want and not go to jail. That's scary. They can't control you. They can't. They, they, they. Did y'all hear what he said? Were y'all not listening? We're, ooh, hoo, hoo. Is this the illest nigga in the bra? Oh, right. How's you reaching? Now y'all went from saying, how's you reaching? How's you bugging? How's you coming with conspiracy theory? Now it's, oh, you ain't the only nigga that's been saying this. I'm the only nigga from the streets that's been waking up the streets, that brought the streets to, to I brought the streets to YouTube. I am the illest nigga in Nebraska. Y'all ain't got to give me my props, man. I've been trying to wake my people up. I've been trying to wake my people up. That's why I sit back and I watch everybody trying to get through the door. All these niggas, like some of the dudes that I used to rock with that don't really want to rock with me unless it's behind the scenes. You know why? Because they don't want to offend the niggas in the industry because they try to get somebody to pull them through the door. They want to get through that door. They want to blood sacrifice their right hand man. Let me tell you something, man. Y'all not paying attention to what's going on right in front of your face and your lying eyes. Which I wasn't paying attention. When I play the sacrifice of the video vixen Aaron Hall. Gloria, y'all wasn't paying attention. Y'all wasn't paying attention when she broke down how she was supposed to be sacrificed. Aaron Hall put her up as a sacrifice and then tried to take her back. He went through the door and still brought her. Tupac saved her. Four months later, Tupac lost his life. Quavo and Takeoff got on Drink Champs and threw shade. At Cardi B, it, it, it offset. 
And uh, yo, I had an eerie feeling the day before he died. Yo, what a time to be live. That fight was staged. That fight would, would, would take off with stage. That boy was sacrificed. That wasn't no fight over no gambling. That was a sacrifice. See, when you go, when you go through the door, when you go through that Norris door, sometimes the sacrifice is you. It's your life. It's not always your family member. So take off. He was sacrificed. Did he know he was going to be sacrificed that night? No. Did Quavo know? Yeah. Did Jay Prince Jr. know? Yeah. Did Offset know? Yeah. Did Cardi know? That boy was sacrificed. Why you think they so quiet? What's taking the police so long to make an arrest? What is taking the police so long to make an arrest? With all those witnesses there. Y'all don't connect the dots and connect the dots and connect the dots. Do you understand? When Martin Luther King went to the hospital, he was still alive. When he got to the hospital to Dr. Doom, he finished him. Martin Luther King, when he got to the hospital, he was still alive. When he got to the hospital, Dr. Doom finished him. King Vaughn was alive. When, before King Vaughn went to the hospital, he had Quando Rondo in the dump feed. He couldn't even get out on the floor. Had him choked up. What did the witnesses say? Vaughn, Vaughn was fine. Until he got into the, uh, the, uh, the ambulance. When he got to the hospital, Dr. Doom finished him. Y'all not paying attention? What y'all what y'all don't understand? And then for some reason, Farrakhan name is always coming up. I've been through Farrakhan in the garbage. You mean they felt like Malcolm X was the biggest threat when all he did was what I'm doing doing right now, using his voice. So Malcolm X, they aired him out in front of his children. His beautiful daughters had to watch him go. But they left you Farrakhan? I threw Farrakhan in the garbage. When I heard him say, after R. Kelly went to the bathroom on a little girl, Farrakhan said, he's still, R. Kelly is still my brother. What? Take the what and leave the what? What? He's still your what? Oh, right. Because when Elijah Muhammad was sitting up there partying with party and bull with them little girls. Right. That's why Malcolm X lost his life. Farrakhan got up on, 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 on TV and said, Bishop Eddie Long, the dude that was running around with all the little young boys in, in, in the club. He was the pie pipe of little boys. He said, he's still my brother. And then you know what? He goes and says, Africa Bambada, the one that decided that he wanted to touch on all the little boys in Bronx River. What did he say? Farrakhan, that's still my brother. That's why you can't tell me nothing about Farrakhan. He might say some of the realest, realest, realest stuff, right? But at the same time, he's one of the, the illest, illest hypocrites ever. They flipped on um, Dr. Khaled for what? Why is Dr. Khaled not here anymore? Died after he got shot. Caught a brain aneurysm. Why? Because they hit him with what? Because he spoke out against who? Right. Them same people that turned Jesus TV off. Right. Yo, 
Yo, hit that like button. Stop playing games. Hit the like button. <laughs> Cause we're not. We, 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 yo, I'm gloating. Because now you got to do Kanye West. Who was supposed to be a billionaire until he broke free of his handlers. So what does that tell you? Everything is an illusion. He was supposed to be a billionaire until he broke free of his shackles that they put on his brain. Jason, that is a song, Campbell. Yes! Yes! Is this the illest nigga in the breath? Y'all gotta share this live, man. Share this live. Share this live because I could guarantee you none of the rest of these dudes is talking the way that I'm talking. They steal my speaking points and then they speak after me. You'll be lucky to get another dude like me after me. As a matter of fact, in the near future, this is the, this is the last stuff because they making it examples. Shout out to my brother AB21. Talk your ish, homie. Take the what and lead the what? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, they mad. That's why they mad. Huh? Because it's always a light-skinned nigga. If it ain't a Farrakhan, it's a Malcolm X. If it ain't a Malcolm X, it's a Hassan Campbell. And this time, the nigga from the Bronx. Oh, don't forget, Tupac was from New York, too, right? Right. We're a little bit different. What did Pac say? He said, I came here to spark the brain of the next revolutionary. And I ain't leaving here till I spark the brain of the next revolutionary. Belby, always on point high. Salute my G. Take the what and leave the what? Talk to him. There's a door. There's a door. There's a door that led to Whitney Houston. There's a door that let, matter of fact, hold up. Wait a minute. Y'all told me I was reaching, right? Y'all told me I was reaching. Let me play this again. Because I want, because I'm about to go in. Ooh, I'm about to go in. Oh. Scary. They can't control you. They can't. They, they, they try to suppress you. But that's how they try to. If they can't control you, they try to suppress you. Matter of fact, should I go? Let me see something real quick. If they can't control you, they try to suppress you. Who's the day? Don't say it. Do not say it. All I really want to say is they don't really care about us. Michael Jackson said, kick me. Don't say it. What's the next word? You will never. All I really want to say is they don't really care about us. How did Michael Jackson die? How did Michael Jackson die? They couldn't get close to him. See, I'm going to tell you what, what, I, what I learned from Michael Jackson's death, right? Let me tell you what I learned from Michael Jackson's death. Haas isolated himself in the house with the wife, the kids, the wife, the kids, the wife, the kids. Michael Jackson put himself the way that he had to go through all of their agencies, even for security. He, become, he became a prisoner in his own home because he got so rich, he couldn't be around the little people no more. And some of these rappers, they can't say that to you. But they became so rich that it was dangerous for them to be around the poor. And it was dangerous for them to be around the rich. So, being that Michael Jackson stayed in his house or in his hotel from traveling, the only ones that could get close to him is through what? Through the system. How did Michael Jackson lose his life? He lost his life through Dr. Doom. Where is the doctor responsible for Michael Jackson's death? Why do we not hear any more about that doctor? I guarantee you nobody never seen him in jail. He ain't never do a day. Images of the doctor that killed Michael Jackson. That's a right And they used a black doctor. Mike went to a black doctor. What y'all don't understand is a door. 
and see what Michael Jackson. Mike, this, Mike, was, Mike didn't just go through that door. He was born in that door. The doctor was all in it for the money. Mike didn't just go through that door. He was born in that door. Stop playing. Serious? Oh no, this is the wrong one. I'm bugging. That's why. I ain't taking no slice from nobody, right? I ain't taking no slice from nobody. It's God. That's the only person that I serve. My mom ain't here. My mama was sacrificed. Me too. You understand? My mama was. My mama was sacrificed. Cause he went through the door. My mama was sacrificed. Yeah, Michael him. Jordan, what about him? His dad, right? Bill Cosby, his son, right? Dr. Dre, his son. You know, out in Hollywood, a lot of people come up missing. Feels like it might be a lot of that in order to control, traumatize, they want to monetize and traumatize. And God love who they want to monetize and traumatize. Is this why? Back in the days, in the early days of, of, of the 2000s, the, er, the, the late 90s, 2000s, they came out with faces to death so that they could get used to you, get you used to watching people die. Because back in my days, you wasn't watching all that murder, murder, kill, kill. On regular TV, you had to go to HBO, and then even certain other things you wasn't going to see. You had to go get Faces of Death from 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 from, from, from CDs, from tapes. Do you understand? They want to monetize and traumatize. The black community is traumatized. It's traumatized. Go ahead, Kanye. You understand? They hit me. Yeah. Adidas, all that away. Still, Forbes, who hate me, right, had to write net worth 400 million. Jesus is king. God loves me. This is the illusion, though. How do you take a dude like Kanye West that had $11 billion, right? Because that's the lie that he was going with. I'm worth $11 billion. How you go from 11 billion to 400 million? How did the narrative change? Why is it that when they decided that Kanye wasn't going to be a billionaire no more, just like that, P. Diddy became a billionaire? How? 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 That's more important than thinking in life. That's the thing. You know what I'm saying? It's, and this truth is going to be heard. Y'all can't send none of y'all meat mills, y'all puppies, y'all little boozy, none of these names, none of these people that have to listen to y'all because they're dealing, they have legal, I never killed nobody, right? I'm the pussy that never killed nobody, right? But that means I can say whatever I want and not go to jail. That's good. So... Was I buzz when I, was I bugging? When I told y'all that Mike Tyson's daughter was sacrificed, allegedly, because I gotta say allegedly, but because I was bugging, because I, I was trying to figure out how was it that Mike Tyson's daughter was in the house running on a treadmill, and then the treadmill plug just mysteriously. Went around her neck while she was running on a treadmill and killed that baby?
be you had to go to HBO and then even certain other things you wasn't going to see. You had to go get Faces of Death from, 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 from CDs, from tapes. Do you understand? They want to monetize and traumatize. The black community is traumatized. It's traumatized. Go ahead, Kanye. You understand? They, they hit me. Gap, Adidas, all that away. Still, Forbes, who hate me, right, had the right net worth 400 million. Jesus is king. God love me. This is the illusion, though. How do you take a dude like Kanye West that had $11 billion, right? Because that's the lie that he was going with. I'm worth $11 billion. How you go from $11 billion to $400 million? How did the narrative change? Why is it that when they decided that Kanye wasn't going to be a billionaire no more, just like that, P. Diddy became a billionaire? How? 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 That's more important than being alive. That's the thing. You know what I'm saying? It's, and this truth is going to be heard. Y'all can't send none of y'all meat mills, y'all puppies, y'all little boozy, none of these names, none of these people that have to listen to y'all because they're dealing, they have legal...